Happy holidays everyone and welcome and or welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Jay Ross and I am your hostess for this 12 Jays of Christmas. This is day eight if I'm not mistaken and that we have finally made it to a video where I'm talking again. Like I mentioned before in another video, uh, holiday depression and seasonal depression is real, okay? I just want y'all to know that. As you guys can tell by the title down below, we are going to be talking about my holiday haul. And because I know you guys love to see me haul things and probably some things that you guys may want for your own Christmas gifts after you collect the money and the gift cards, let's just go ahead and get into it. So this is from Kiss Professional New York, or I think it's Kiss New York Professional. These are their Glam Shine lip glosses and I actually won these in a giveaway. They asked me to pick out three shades and I picked up the shade Clear, Crystal Aqua, Gold Spot. So I've won these before but this time I got to pick the shades that I wanted and of course you can never go wrong with a clear gloss. You can never go wrong with the gloss that appears clear on your lips with a little gold shimmer and then you can never go wrong with a gold gloss in general. So I picked the ones that I knew I would use the most and I also got three of their Fierce Cream Lipsticks. I have it in the shade 03 Spice, 11 Rich Berry, and this last one is 04 red orange oh snaps i forgot about this giveaway dupe that had the giveaway to give out the ColourPop x mba collection and i won the miami heat collection which i totally forgot because y'all know i don't roll it with color pop like that but i totally forgot i entered it and i actually forgot that i won it so yay and that's super awesome because now i have something sports related on the NBA side in my makeup collection and that's awesome. So next up, I'm going to open up this box from Sephora. If you know me, if you pay attention to what I put on my Instagram and my stories and what I talk about in my makeup wish list things that I talk about on my Instagram stories, then you might know what this is. So of course we have to start off with these samples because you know, who doesn't love a good sample? These are the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. These are samples of those. My other sample is the Juliet Has a Gun, Not a Perfume. Wait, is it not a perfume, but it is a perfume? What is this? So this is not a perfume, but it's a perfume. Y'all childish. <laughs> this is the birthday gift that I picked up, which includes the Afterglow Lip Balm, as well as the Laguna, Bronzer? Yeah, it's in there. I don't, I don't feel like doing all that right now. And then I also picked up the Born This Way Super Coverage Concealer in the shade Chai. We all know I have it. I love it. I have it in the shade Chestnut, but I have been uh, scraping the bottle on this for a while now and they haven't had chestnut in stock for a while. So I said, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try to try and we're gonna see if it works for me. So I'm hoping it works and if not, y'all need to create some more uh, ch uh, chestnut. Could creating all these better than sex, mascara, bolts and the same repetitive crap. Restock on this please. Thank you. And then last but not least from Sephora, the thing that you guys are probably already knowing that I picked up. And let's just talk about how special it comes in its own little package. Not little, it comes in its own package. And let's see who can guess what this is. Pause the video right now. Take a guess down below. And let me know if you got it right. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. That is not like waiting music. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, you guessed it. This is the new Pat McGrath Labs holiday palette for the 2021 year. And it is called the Mothership Mega Celestial Odyssey palette. Why does this look way bigger than the one from last year? Where is mine from last year? It's back on my shelf. I wanna open it. I'm not gonna swatch it, but I wanna open it so we can all look at it together. And of course you guys know there will be a video coming on this or at least be some looks around it. This is the palette. Of course, 
camera doesn't do it justice because we all know there's some duochrome, reflective type, what not, all that good stuff. So there it is. The mirror is covered up, of course. There is this beautiful palette, 18 shades. Next up, let's do this a box from Ulta. I mean, you guys know if I have a Sephora haul, I gotta do an Ulta haul too. You know, it's just a competitor in me that's just like bring the rivals together in the same video. <laughs> so not makeup, but something that I absolutely love is the good girl Carolina or Carolina Herrera perfume set. This is the very good girl. And then this is the good girl. Next up, and this might be something that my beauty bloggers, social media people, people who do content like me would love for a gift. So if you're looking for gifts of what to get somebody, I think I may have found the one for you. This is the Con Air LED Hollywood Lighted Social Media Mirror. Very inexpensive and I'm really excited to try it out and you guys will be getting my feedback on it. But if you wanna grab this while it's on sale right now in Ulta for the holidays, please do so. Next up is another box from Ulta. Because when it's your birthday month and you want all the points, live it up okay first up is this i think it was like free with purchase bag this is from clinique clinique pop lip color plus primer in the shade 02 bear pop which is a pretty new shade i was trying to see if it had shimmer i think it does a little bit but there is that shade you guys know i love my nude so i'm happy they sent this color and then what else is in here this is the Take the Day Off Makeup Remover for Lids, Lashes, Lips. I love this liquid form as well as the one that comes in the little like skincare container. Um, love that. Love both of these. They really do work. They are worth the price. But when you can get a sample, take advantage of that too. This is the iDesign lipstick container holder or whatever makeup product I feel like putting in this. 18 slots that I can use. Very sturdy acrylic and was very inexpensive and was on sale even with the holiday stuff so if you want storage items because we all know as i hinted last year or told you guys last year storage acrylic or whatever are very good gifts at least in my opinion next up we have the almay biodegradable oil free micellar eye makeup remover pads this is 120 pads hypoallergenic I love these things. I love these things. I love these things. For eye makeup, get off the glitter with no problem. Like I have no problem. Even the strongest pigments don't leave the pigment. Like they don't stain my eyes because these are really good. And also the primer that you put underneath also helps with that too. So, ladies and gentlemen, introducing the Urban Decay X Marvel E. Yeah, I bought it. You know why? Because it was on sale. You know why else I bought it? Because I had coupons to make it a super sale. So I wasn't paying $60 for it. And guess what? Your girl didn't pay anywhere near 60. She paid way less than half price as well too. So can't go wrong with that. As a Marvel person, was I excited about this color palette? Not whatsoever. I thought the color story was pretty blah. Has your girl even seen the Eternals? No, no, I have not. So for this movie to be the one that broke my streak, I don't know how I feel about that. So I thought I'd make it up by buying the palette. It's not like I didn't want to see, like I did want to see the Eternals, but stuff happened and your girl was just like, okay, I guess it's not a priority right now, even though we all know I love Marvel. And by the way, have y'all been watching Hawkeye? Here's the reason why I bought this palette. Do you, I forgot that it does the holographic reflective thing. But do you see this overall packaging? Do you see the fact that it's blue? Let's just talk about that first of all. Hence, I mean, blue background, so clearly I love blue things. But do you see the packaging? You see that, right? And then you're like, okay, Jay, it's just basic packaging. No, 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 it, it gets better. It gets better. And this is the first time I'm doing this in person, so this is kind of cool. Do you see this part though? Do y'all see? Do you see? You see? That's why Jay needs to have this palette. I mean, we can actually get to the actual palette, but that part right there, just, just that part. Okay, I'm done, okay. And then this is the eyeshadow palette. Like I said, nothing too amazing. 
when it comes to the color story we all know i'm going to use the blue sooner or later um but this is a pretty natural neutral palette that i feel like anybody can use oh even the inside of the box is like galactic and star and stuff like that that's cute See, the packaging hate me. I'll be like, okay, Urban Decay, you made a comeback. And then I swiped over on the pictures and saw the swatches and the shades. And I was like, what the devil? So next is this package from No Name, of course. Um, but I actually know what this package is. And hopefully you guys are excited with me because just be excited. Let me have my moment. Y'all know I love my unboxing. It's like I do PR hauls and I just can't wait until I make it to the point where I can be on PR hauls. I swear, it's gonna be like Christmas every day for me. Ladies and gentlemen, Juvia's Place. Do you see? Do you see how happy your girl is? Do you see? This is how happy I am for real because I'm super excited to finally have a blue palette that actually has the shades I want in the palette. No, I won't forgive you guys. Add me on Instagram. This is the Allure 2 palette. There are three palettes in this series or collection, but your girl wants the blue one, okay? I didn't care about the other two. I finally got my blue palette from Juvia's Place, guys. I finally have it. Also, I bought the holiday mystery bag or box from um, Juvia's Place. So in that, or at least in mine, the palette that they gave me was the Nubian 2 palette, Ice Loose Highlighter. And then the last thing that came in my holiday mystery box was the glass lip gloss in the shade It's Electric. And then because I love these lipsticks so much, I went back to pick up the Nudes Chocolate and the Nudes Peaches. This is in the shade Lady as well as Me. These are the Velvet Matte Lipsticks that I told you guys reminded me very much of the Pat McGrath Labs Matte Trance lipsticks. I'm keeping these, but you guys at least got four things out of this package that will end up in a giveaway. So you might want to stay tuned because I'm coming with the gifts for Christmas. You may not get it by Christmas, of course, but y'all might want to stay tuned to your girl. And we have the very last gift. So very last gift i said that because it's wrapped up like a gift but this is the very last box for this haul ladies and gentlemen glam light x icy is in your girl's hand not the full collection because your girl didn't need the full collection and i'm gonna get into that when i talk about this individual palette when i do the review for it but let's just say this wasn't one of my favorite collection themes not the theme but the pack let's just get into this look, look at this do y'all see do y'all see this look at this look at that blue gorgeousness okay this is the glam light concha highlighter clearly it's in a holiday box so of course i picked up their holiday gift set this is kind of where they got their start and like everybody started to realize like oh they do stuff based off of food I think it might have been this one or it might have been another one, but so I got that. So this is the Glam Donut, which is the most glamorous donut you've ever seen. Comes with those shades. If you guys remember this from last year, this was a part of their Chocolate Factory collection that I really, 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 really wanted, but I didn't want all those lashes in it. And I really wanted it because of this, like the S'mores highlighter, the marshmallow one, like that, it was just so beautiful. I'm not gonna open it because it's plastic in case and I don't want this video to be longer than it already is but this is a s'mores highlighter and it looks like a s'mores bar once again this is part of the chocolate factory collection which when I saw this I swore up and down it was going to be an eyeshadow palette and then they finally showed it and it is a pair of lashes you guys see so those are the lashes. I used to be upset with Glam Light. I'm like, every collection, does it have to come with lashes? Can't you get an option without the lashes, but still buy the full collection and stuff like that? And then they started doing collections with no lashes. Their last two or three collections were with no lashes. 
So they must have heard you, girl. I mean, I ain't reap none of the benefits of it because I still pay full price. But you know, it's neither here nor there. Next up in the holiday set, we have this red velvet lipstick. And there's that. All these reds are coming out definitely for the holiday for sure. They're like, Jay, you got to do more red looks for the holiday. I don't want to. <laughs> then we have the Caramel Frappe Lippy. That is so pretty. You guys know I love my new shades and I love the packaging of stuff. I really do. I'm all about packaging, but I'm pretty sure this shade is similar to one that I have from the ice cream collection. So just may go to you. And then last but not least is this Glam Light Diner Restaurant Wipes. It is makeup wipes, but it's cute because it's themed. Second of all, you know I'm vacillating here. Trying. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you guys really did enjoy this video. As I mentioned, there will be a giveaway. This giveaway will end up on my Instagram. So please go ahead and enter. If you want a bonus entry, let me know your Instagram name down below and make sure you are subscribed to my channel and let me know you are part of the J Crew J fam. And let me know if any of this stuff was on your wish list or will you be adding it to your wish list or will you be buying it? Don't forget to turn your notification bell on as I will be uploading videos for the rest of the 12 days of Christmas. Hopefully I can get more looks out to you guys. I'm gonna get out of my mental space, my, I'm gonna get out of my head and I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to upload more looks, hopefully, to give you guys some ideas of what to do for your holiday parties. Once again, I am your hostess, J Ross. Please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all are staying safe, happy, healthy, and blessed. And I will see you guys in my next one. Happy holidays, everybody. Peace.